It's Hannah Ash, and now we do indeed bring in Carrie Yaruso, who I hope brought her dancing shoes to this post-game interview. You're going to show what's your go-to? What's your go-to TikTok dance? I we got to like, see it. Oh, I don't have like a go-to dance, but I like to do like the fast speed one. So right. I'll put in like slow mo and then it looks really fast when you... Show me something. Um, Come I, on. No. Oh, <laughs> all right. Hey, uh, 100 career points. Congratulations. That's an awesome number. I, I know you have bigger goals. I know that are things that you want to accomplish that are more significant than that. But what does that mean to you to reach that milestone? Um, it was super exciting. I think what was more exciting about it was I didn't really know what was happening and neither did anyone else. So, like, it was super cool, like, <laughs> seeing everybody, like, cheer for me because it really goes to show that, like, we really are, like, a very close-knit team and everyone cares about each other. That's awesome. That's awesome. Uh, what Coach was talking about, obviously, you know, you and I have talked more before about being an all-around player, but that, that defensive effort that you guys put in today and you – it being such a huge part of that and being, you know, someone that everybody else is taking their cues from, how important was it for you to lead the charge that way? Um, I think it was super important, especially like towards the end when they were face guarding. I was um, like in my head, I was like, I just need to play really good defensively because I knew that obviously I wasn't going to be as big of a factor offensively. But um, we played as a really good as a team today, and I think everybody just had their backs on defense. All right, now calling plays. Is this something you've ever done before? I mean, usually we repeat it, but like I don't usually have to actually call it. Okay, so talk me through it. What was it like? What was what did you learn from going through something like that? And do you feel like it's something that you can do moving forward? Yeah, definitely. I think it's like also as you're playing, what feels good, what plays are working um, a lot in the beginning. You know, we know the ones that we like to run during practice. So I started with those. And then as I was kind of out of the play, I was just kind of getting a vibe from the other girls and seeing what they wanted to do. Okay. So did they ever criticize you? Did you ever say like, Kara, what, what was, what was that? That was, that was all, no. <laughs> that was cool. Um, we talked about it, obviously a disappointing loss Wednesday, but a nice win today. What, what's the message from you to the young players on this team, knowing what's coming up this coming Wednesday and a huge matchup with Messiah? Um, I think a big thing that changed from uh, Wednesday to today was everyone played their roles and they played their roles well today. And I think that everyone um, you know, realized that they are a huge part of the team in a different way. And today everybody stepped up and did their role well. And that's what you need moving forward. All right, since you won't give us a TikTok dance, how about instead go to karaoke song? Ooh. I like Wanna Be by Spice Girls. Really? <laughs> you weren't even born then. Yeah, my, my older sister loves that song. Okay. So like it's just like on repeat. Alright, alright. <laughs> any chance? You no. give us will you give us a, will you give us any bars at all? Ooh, definitely not. We tried. <laughs> Carrie Russo. Anybody else that you didn't shout out last time you need to shout out this time? Uh, my sisters Kelly and Krista couldn't make it today, so shout out you guys and thank you the rest of you for coming. <laughs> Hey, congratulations, uh, not only on the milestone, but a huge win. We'll see you back here Wednesday, all right? Thank you. That's Carrie Russo. I'm Glenn Clark. This has been GoMustangSports.tv.